Assalamualaikum and salam sejahtera. We are from Group 4. We will present about artificial sea production of one seawater fish species, which is grouper. We start with the definition first. Artificial seed production is the manipulation of sexually matured fish to spawn or reproduce in captivity by some stimulants, hormone or pituitary extract injection. Okay, next we'll be talking about types of artificial seed production. There are two types, which is artificial spawning with hormonal treatment and artificial spawning without hormonal treatment. Okay, the first one is artificial spawning with hormonal treatment. It obtains sexually matured broodstock either through hormonal treatment or not. And the mature females are injected with hormones in order to provoke the mating and spawning processes and then placed in fill ponds at a density of two females and one male per 100 meter cube. Spawning usually takes place during the night after the hormone treatment and the breeders then remove the following morning. The next one is artificial spawning without hormonal treatment. It extracts the eggs and sperm manually. Fertilization is done manually and the eggs are incubated. Mature breeders can be reproduced artificially by simulating the events which will occur during the rainy season which will trigger off the mating and spawning processes. Ponds of about 400m3 in size are filled with 20cm of water and stocked with 6 mature females and 4 males. A few hours later, the water level is raised up to a level of 50 to 60 cm. The spawning will occur at night and the following morning, the breeders can be removed. Since 1993, uh, the grouper fish aquaculture production was uh, rapidly increased, uh, about 10 until 77% uh, per year. Uh, the fish has immense potential in the trade market and also well accepted in the domestic market. Uh, the importance of artificial seed production in grouper is uh, to obtain large quantity of um, fish seed uh, to obtain high quality seed uh, to make fingerlings uh, readily available throughout the year to reduce uh, dependency on white stock uh, to create better conditions for growth and survival of fish and then to ensure the availability of parasite and disease free uh, fish seed the aquaculture sector is becoming increasingly important in supplying the population's food demand. Artificial seed production is one of the most important aspects of ensuring sustainable development of the aquaculture industry. However, some challenges must be resolved before artificial seed production may progress further in the future. Fish disease, environmental pollution, availability of high skin technician, high cost of infrastructure, mortality of male fish and egg were some of the challenges farmers face in artificial seed production of marine fish. To begin with, fish illness has frequently resulted in animals that fry and adult fish in fish farm and hatcheries. Poor water quality, overcrowding and overfeeding are all common cause of fish disease. It can be solved by using experience and research to improve water quality control and time maintenance. Furthermore, contamination of the environment around the hatcheries and fish farm was due to aquaculture practice. Circulated water from fish farm is frequently enriched with fish meals and chemical used in fish treatment. It can be solved by installing water purification system and enforcing regulation on the use of specific chemicals in aquaculture. In addition, there is a shortage of highly experienced uh, technicians to handle artificial seed production because early stage of fish have a high 
mortality rate, adequate and competent care is required to produce good quality seeds. Moreover, farmers may face financial difficulties because artificial seed production requires significant investment for certain equipment and infrastructure, ponds, tanks, and water supply. Artificial reproduction is similar to induced spawning, except sperm is collected by crushing the testes of the male fish because their anatomy prevents them from obtaining milk through normal abdominal pressure. This involves the sacrifice of the male, which is a huge inconvenience. Immortality can be caused by a variety of factors. Four of them are abrasion. Uh, the broodstock help must be ensured by providing adequate feed for a sufficient period of time prior to spawning. For certain farm fish, it is not yet possible to understand and control all the stage of reproduction and farmers depend on natural supply. To make sure that the seedling production success there is a few steps that need to be taken care. First is the parent culture. Second is artificial propagation. Third is seed rearing. Fourth is transferring the seedling to the pond. And the fifth is temporarily put the grouper in net cage. Parent culture. Select the white parent or farm parent that had good characteristics. Place the parent in seedling rearing room or in net cage. The fish were fed with fresh shrimp, small fish or oyster and right amount of vitamin E were added. The fish were fed twice per day with proper care of their women. Artificial propagation. Healthy parents with strong good coloration and devoid of any skeletal abnormalities and injuries were selected. Group of parents were injected with oxytocin to mature the egg and sperm. After 12 to 24 hours, the egg were fertilized before were placed in the nursery pond. The suitable water temperature for hatching is 25 to 30 degrees Celsius. Dissolve oxygen more than 6 mg per liter and pH between 7 to 7.9. Seed rearing. The newly hatched larvae and pre larvae are cultivated in nursery pond. Transferring seed to the pond. After 30 to 34th day, the young post larvae already develop dorsal fin, anal fin, and tail fin ray. The youngster cultivation can be continued in more bigger space or pond. Net cage as temporary support. 35 days old young grouper can be put in 2C area net cage temporarily. The water source for the net cage need to be clean, pollution free with suitable water temperature and salinity more than 1.05. The young grouper scale develop after 50 to 60 days in the net cage. Next is the application of fish seed production. Fish seed production is applied in aquaculture farming system. It is applied during spawning where the fish will be injected with hormone. It is used to help in overcome these difficulties which is obtaining a sufficient number of eggs good hatching rate of the eggs, good survival and growth of the larvae. There is, there is very high mortality at this stage. So, by using artificial fish seed production, this problem can be solved.